Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Becca from Matt Home in the Sun and today I am back to do our first savings challenge cash stuffing for the month of June. So I'm so excited that you guys are here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and following along with me and stuffing some cash with me. So today we're gonna be cash stuffing our savings challenges. So in my last video, we did a cash stuffing of our expenses and sinking funds. So this is a video where we get to have a little bit of fun and a of our fun challenges. So let's go ahead and count and see how much money we're working with today. We have one, two, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 400, one, two, three. So we have $403 that we're gonna be working with today. So let's get everything set up. How are you guys doing? It is a beautiful day here in South Florida. The sun is shining. It is very hot outside, but it is a very beautiful day. We've been having a lot of rain. I know other places in the US um, really need rain really bad. So I hope you guys are getting the rain that you need and that everybody is staying healthy and happy. So if you are new here, what we do with our money that we have set aside for our savings challenges is we stuff them into our various savings challenges and savings challenges can look different for everybody. So the way that we pick challenges is we usually have a goal that we are working towards. So some of my savings challenges may be going towards debt. Some may be going towards doing something fun with my kids. We do have one savings challenge that is um, saving for an out of state wedding that we have to go to. Um, so things like that. We also have a coin savings challenge and a dollar savings challenge, and those don't have a specific purpose. We just wanna save that money. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get started with our 3K savings challenge. And this binder is from Iris Budget. She makes such, such pretty savings challenge binders. Go check her out, go check out her YouTube channel and her Etsy store, it will be linked in the description down below. So this challenge is what we're using to save for that out of state wedding that I mentioned. And we're doing very, very well on it, the wedding is in September of this year. So today we're gonna to be adding $300 to this. So we're gonna mark off three 100s, one, two, and three. We are absolutely crushing this challenge, I have to say. Um, I was a little bit worried that we weren't gonna be able to save up um, the money in time, but I have really buckled down and tried really, really hard to make sure that we fund this one. And I'm pretty confident that we're not gonna need that much money um, for the wedding. So whatever is left over, um, I'm trying to decide like what to do with it. Probably stuff it into another savings challenge. So that will be something to think about. Um, we do have to buy our plane tickets still. Um, we haven't done that. That's gonna be the biggest expense, probably around $1,000 for all five of us um, to fly out of state. All right, so those $300 are stuffed. Let me just look real quick and see how many envelopes we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. Okay, 11 envelopes left. Most of them are 50s. Right, I'm so happy you guys, so happy that we're gonna be done with this challenge very, very soon and that wedding will be completely funded. All right, now we are gonna be stuffing my 20 envelope savings challenge for the first time today, but I'm gonna hold off a little bit on this. I'm so excited because this is my own challenge that um, a bunch of you have bought. I am currently sold out right now, but um, I'm gonna be stuffing this for the first time. Um, a lot of you have bought this and you guys have been stuffing yours because I've been hearing about it and I'm so happy that this has been so popular and that so many people have given me such great feedback on it and I'm super excited to stuff it. But we're gonna be stuffing um, my savings challenge binder first. So let's go ahead and do this. So our first challenge in here is the mom can we savings challenge and we have um, completed this one already once this year. So this is the second time that we are working on it. So let me grab my Sharpie over here. So we are gonna be adding $10 today. So it looks like I don't have any more $10 hearts. So I think I'm going to, let's see, what should I color in? Let's just do a two and an eight. So I don't have a specific, um, event or anything in mind for what we're saving for um with this one last time we used it on a movie day and the kids had so much fun and we used the last bit of it on sushi 
Um, so it's just like fun things like that that the kids like to do. So let's see, we're gonna be adding $10. So let's do that with two fives. So isn't this envelope pretty? I love the vinyl on this. This um, particular challenge is from Easy Budgets over on Etsy. So we have 10, 20, 30, and $40 saved so far in the Mom Can We Savings Challenge. All right, so um, we are not gonna be doing roll with it in this video. We will be doing it in my next savings challenge video. This is our random challenge that we do use a 10 sided die with. So we're not gonna be doing that one, like I said, until we fully fund June. So we're gonna move on to our 12 month savings challenge and we have fully funded all of these so far. May is done. So we are working on June. And when June is fully funded, we will do the roll with it challenge to reallocate um, our June funds into one of our sinking funds. So it's just a fun challenge. I really, really enjoy doing it just to add a little bit more money to one of our sinking funds. So for June, we're gonna be adding $20. So let me grab that 20 and add it to the other. So we added $30 um, in the last video. So each icon is worth $10. So we're gonna be coloring in our martini glasses today. Okay, so I think the only thing that I'm going to be coloring on these martinis are the olives. So let's go ahead and color in those olives. And there we go. All right, that looks cute. I like it. All right, so June is now fully funded. So let's see, the money got put under here. So we have $20, $40, and $50. Perfect. So we do like to say $50 per month in this challenge. All right, so that is done. So this binder is done. So now we can get on to the part that I am super excited about, which is stuffing my 20 envelope savings challenge for the very first time. All right, so today we're gonna be stuffing $65. Now this is the way that I have chosen to do this. I did make a video about um, I think it was like seven ways that you could use this challenge. There's so many different ways you can use it. You guys can come up with your own ways. Um, you do have 20 envelopes that are numbered just like that. So the way that I have chosen to do this is to round up to the next five. So for envelopes one through five, I will stuff $5. Envelope six through 10, I will stuff $10. Envelopes 11 through 15, I will stuff $15 in each one of those. And then 16 through 20, I will stuff $20 into each one of those. So for our $65, we are gonna be stuffing um, these three 20s and also a five. So that is our $65. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stuff my very first envelope here. Like I said, we are rounding up to the next five. So we're gonna be stuffing $5 into this and we do insert our money on the back of the envelope. So it will look like that from the front. And then let's go back here to the back and we're gonna stuff three of these. So let's stuff um, uh, 16, 17, and 18 with our 20s. So if you are someone who has purchased this, let me know how it's going for you because I know um, a lot of people on Etsy and also on YouTube have been leaving me comments. Um, very positive feedback for the most part for this challenge. So I'm really, really happy to hear that. Um, so let me know how it's going if you are doing this challenge currently and how it's working out for you. I would love to hear. All right, so we have stuffed four envelopes so far. So, isn't it so cute? It's so tiny and cute, I love it. All right, so that is stuffed. So we're gonna be moving on to my $1 savings challenge and also my coins. And let me just show you my coins. So like I got my husband to clean out the coins out of his car. Look at all these quarters. I'm so excited to stuff these because last time we stuffed coins, I only had two coins. Um, I had like a penny and a quarter. So I am very excited to stuff all of this today. So let's go ahead and stuff our $1 first. So I do have these $3 that we're gonna be stuffing. Also, I wanted to stuff five more, but I didn't have any more singles. So we're just gonna go ahead and stuff this $5 in here. So um, $8 going into our $1 savings challenge. Everything in here is ones except for that five I just stuck in there. 
And I believe we did stuff a 10 in there at some point. So there's a 10 in there somewhere. This is a long-term challenge. I have no plan for this money and I have no like end date or anything. So we're just doing this for as long as I feel like it basically. So that is all stuffed. All right, so let's go ahead and move on to our coins. Let me move some of this out of the way so we have some room to organize our coins here. All right, so let's see what we're working with. Ooh, look at all these quarters. All right. Let's see, we got some dimes and nickels. Most of these are quarters. One more nickel. Okay. Awesome. Look at all those quarters. Let's see, one, two, three, four, four twenty-five in quarters. That's awesome. All right, so we're going to be starting with pennies. So let me grab my penny savings challenge. These are available in my Etsy shop. I may or may not be sold out of them when this video posts. I'm not sure. Um, I am going to be restocking though if you do go to purchase and I am sold out. So no worries. I will be restock restocking very soon. All right, so three cents. So one, two, three, when we get to the end of a row, we do mark off at the bottom. So it's quick um, and easy to see how much you've saved. So 82 cents and pennies. When this is full, I will be rolling these pennies. Um, I am not probably gonna take them back to the bank though until the end of the year. So I can see how much that we have saved for the entire year. All right, pennies are done. So let's move on to nickels. All right, so we have three nickels here. One, two, three. Great. Okay. And let's move on to dimes. So we have 20 cents to stuff today. Go ahead and toss these in here before I mark them off. So let's see how we're doing on dimes. So, oh great, we're at the end of this row. All right, so we have saved $2.10 in dimes so far this year. And I'm really interested to see where we are with the quarters. So let's move on to quarters. Okay. So let's see how many we have. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, and 17. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17. All right, so we crossed off 750 and we crossed off $10, $11.50. All right, so we're at $11.50 for our quarters and when this whole thing is filled up we'll, we will have saved $25 in quarters that's pretty amazing all right so let me grab all of these okay Ooh, that's a lot of quarters all right so we are all done stuffing our coins so that is it for this savings challenge video thank you guys so much for following along and spending some of your time with me i really appreciate it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you're not subscribed please consider subscribing to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys